Line in. Bluetooth audio. Bluetooth audio. Bluetooth. So close. Bluetooth audio. If your waist begins with a two, eat. What's up guys? So basically today we're gonna to be taking you through our day. So this day is interesting because I actually finished my meal prep for the day. Kyle, I said don't bring anything. We're gonna see what we can do when we eat out. It's very hard to hit your macro, especially your protein when you eat out. So we're gonna go through what we did to get our day to make sure we're hitting our numbers, especially for this shred. So first things first, we both had two scoops of protein in the morning. Now you guys can kind of see where we at. We got a huge day coming up. We got a big interview. Uh, so we're just gonna get our way to the bus station and then we'll see you there. Hey, 90 likes. This guy coming and saying, Hey, hey, what's up, bro? Hey, how you doing? Oh shit, that was awkward. Let's make a run here. Oh, yeah, I always do that. Too long. Hey, bro, how you get doing? taller, eh? Reminds me of Scott, eh? Yeah. What are we out here doing, guys? Uh, get Justin, dude. He's the interviewer. Hey, Justin, what's going on, buddy? We're here to learn a little bit more about Colossus Fitness and how you guys kick ass. Hey. You do kick ass, don't you? Love oh it. yeah. So this setup is pretty freaking crazy in here. We've got. Yeah, we should film our um. That. Videos here. That. Oh, there's Josh on the screen right there. That's pretty cool. And then you guys will be able to see Josh in that right there, 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 there. 15 seconds. So Josh, start off by telling me a little bit about uh, what Colossus Fitness does. Uh, so Colossus Fitness, we're primarily a YouTube channel, so we offer a lot of how-tos. We kind of go through our lives and what we do as competitors. Okay, now I imagine you aren't always this huge. Uh, how long have you been working out? Uh, I've been start? working out for about five years. I was relatively skinny before I was a smaller person. I kind of started with hockey, and then I kind of just fell in love with the weightlifting aspect, and I stuck with it. Okay, that's, that's good. Thank you. Yeah. All right. Killed it, bro. Damn, that was well done. So what do you think, big guy? It's good. It's fun. Coffee time. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Well done, buddy. Boy Justin. So how long did it take Just to review those questions? Uh, I think I made them on the subway right here this morning. Oh yeah? Bags Excellent. my eyes. Our kind of guy right there. To bring that to air at 3 o'clock, so stay tuned. Uh, it's like, important today. You know? yeah. we'll, uh, we'll link it in our video. Yeah, dude, it's we'll, just, it's just important. Want to put your Instagram too? Yeah, do it. I'm invincible. Jeez. Yo, buddy, I thought you hated coffee. Nah, Josh got me into it, man. <laughs> You're like a fiend now, dude. No. Yeah. Starting our morning off with a nice coffee. It's what we like to do in the morning. Nice um, big cup of joe, bro. Got a lot of coaching stuff. It's gonna be a long day, so we're gonna get fired up, caffeinated. Let's go. What did you order, bro? Oh, we've, what we've got here is a deluxe premium latte from Balzac's, medium. That's money. Best of the best. Top of a little bit of uh, cocoa dash on top. <laughs> <laughs> I just got class coffee. I go two cream. How do you go? Uh, two milk, two sugar. Fire. You guys got to. So we just finished doing our coaching work. Because we met up so early to do the interview, we didn't really eat much. All I had for breakfast was two scoops of my EHP whey. So basically I got my protein out of the way and now we can kind of take an intermittent fasting standpoint. We can have a nice big lunch, as you can see. We went to Blaze Pizza, our spot. And uh, my goal with my macros right now, especially with this mini cut, if I want to eat like this, I need to use these apps to make sure I'm being as accurate as possible and to hit the goals I want. To keep it really low fat, high protein, high carb, what I did here was I got a ton of chicken, a ton of turkey, stayed away from the salamis and the other kind of meats like that, kept the vegetables high. So as you can see, I got it to six fat, which is pretty friggin' amazing for one sixth of the pizza, 19 carbs and 15 protein. Those are some pretty good macros. You can take a slice. Fire up, bro. Another thing to lower our fat, we like to put goat cheese. Uh, it does have a little bit of a soury kind of taste, but we enjoy it. Compared to the mozzarella, which actually is very high in fat, gets spread around a lot more, will lead to more fat. So we're just watching that for the day, making sure we're hitting our macros. Yeah. <laughs> okay, another cool tip for you Diet Coke lovers. Now 
I could eat anything. For pot lovers, if you are gonna indulge and go for it, I recommend getting a water first, because while you're eating your meal, you're gonna be thirsty. You're not gonna care what you're drinking. So you can just get your plain old, healthy, natural water. And then after, you can go for your Diet Coke and you won't drink as much, and then you'll remove some of the bloating from it afterwards. All right, guys, so right now I'm gonna ship the uh, prizes that the giveaway winner won. Got it right there, we've got Colossus shirt. And then here are the bands and then everything else we said we'd give right in there. So yeah, congrats Umar, thanks for uh, entering guys, stay tuned. Guys, so now we're about to head to class. The cool thing about this, and the class is actually in a movie theater, check it out. Halal, halal! We getting shawarmas. We're getting shawarmas. You ever tried shawarma? There's a shawarma joint about two blocks from here. I don't know what it is, but I want to try it. It says Bilal Pizza. But we're getting shawarmas. Next stop of the food journey. <laughs> you got your baby in? Yeah, I just like posing with it. You know what I mean? This is a shawarma. A little nugget of joy here. So now it feels pretty dense. You got some good weight to it. And this is about a thousand calories if you ask them to go light on the sauce. So this basically brings me to my caloric intake of 3,000 calories. As you guys have seen, we've been eating out all day, but we've been having a lot of veggies, making sure to hit our fiber goals with this, with the pizza. We're not eating stuff that makes us feel like crap. Um, it's got a lot of veggies. Yeah, it's got a lot of veggies. Like we make sure to hit our micronutrients like crazy. Those are very important. Just because we're eating out all day doesn't mean we're gonna have Burger King and Wendy's all day. We are fitness athletes, IFYM, doing it right. That is Bay. Menchies is Bay. All right, so last stop of the day for our going out foods, Menchies. Most of these are pure carbs, no fat. We've got our goldfish one, which sounds disgusting, but it's delicious. Red velvet cupcake, which takes king, and cake batter. These are the top three. We've been sampling them like crazy, but we can't really do that with the camera. Why are you gonna be so weird with how you doing it? Am I? Just do it normal. <laughs> I am doing it normal. Because I get What's it around. choice number two? Choice number two, cake batter. All right, so you're skipping the velvet. I'm sick of skipping the velvet. Quit it. Mm. How much is that? That's this is this is five. All right, toppings. I love me just a few, just a few score pieces. Does it fit your macros? Yeah, it does. What else you got? Ooh, gold. They have the goldfish. You got a match. Uh, you have to match, bro. I gotta get a few of the goldfish. Alright guys, so we just fired up Menchies. Uh, we had a bunch of carbs left for the day, probably like just over 50. Um, and I then like 120, dude. Oh, you did? <laughs> <laughs> to, uh, to grab that. We didn't have too much fat left, which is why we stuck to the low to no fat. This isn't something we always do like Josh mentioned at the start of the video. Um, we were just out all day, super busy. So the reason we don't like to do it, as Kyle just said, is that there's a lot of preservatives, we have less control. So realistically, we hit our macros, but it's hard to say because we're not controlling these portions mm -hmm. unless we come out, bring a scale, measure everything out, which is very hard to do, especially in things like a shawarma or a pizza. Unless you're Guzman. Yeah, unless you're Guzman, but <laughs> if he can weigh out a shawarma, he's the man. Thanks for watching, guys. Next Rising Legends is gonna be all gym footage. We love you all. We hope you enjoyed this video and enjoyed watching our day. Want some more tips? Be sure to check out the other videos in this series. It's a banging series, episode 10, coming on strong. Peace.